Spark TV. Metal in action. So hi everybody out there. You are watching Spark TV. You know metal in action. And what can I say? But this is rage. This is rage. This is rage. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe you remember we were sitting there last year, uh, and we were talking about a new album. Now we will talk about new album too. So guys, it was so quick, fast. Uh, yeah, quick. What happened? We are, we feel good, and that's that's producing a lot of sounds. It's a good feeling, yeah. We didn't force ourselves; it just happened by itself. We were so quick, actually, before release of the last album, we had already five songs done for this album now, <laughs> and by end of October, the album was 90% done. So, when you decided, or when and how you decided to record a new album, when came the moment? Okay, we have the ideas. Well, we we had a lot of ideas. Uh, af I mean, before, like people said, before the release of the album, we have a few songs already written, and uh, we talked with our partners from Nuclear Blast, and they say, "Hey, we have more songs in there," and they were like, they loved the ideas. Okay, let's just go for another album uh, and make uh, the brother of this one that we are about to release. That was last year, right? You feel it like a small brother or big brother? <laughs> yes. Big brother is watching. Yeah, no, he's watching <laughs> it. Yes, I mean those two albums um, definitely belong together. Like uh, Marcus and Pv said before, that is um, is like like with Halloween Keepers One and Keepers Two. Uh, we see those two albums as really like like brothers. The one was our first in this lineup, and then this is the the, the logical evolution maybe of uh, of what we've then done so far. Well, and Pv, I think the. The typical thing for the new material is the, the sound of guitars. It's so huge. We increase a lot in the guitar sound, which is also <coughs> um, a bit uh, uh, um, the fault of Mr. Dan Suano, we just met him downstairs, who did the mixing of uh, the stuff. And um, I don't know where you kind of un unsatisfied with the last uh, album no, guitar. I, know, no? I wasn't unsatisfied, but I want to go one step further. and. Uh, I've been do uh, I've been doing mail bombing with uh, <laughs> with Dan about the guitar sound, and we suggest to get the best out of it. I record with two amps simultaneously, uh, my angle amps, and then uh, you know he back and forth looking for the right sound. And at some point, we found the absolutely astonishing album sound of the guitar, and say, okay, we have to keep this one. And uh, if it's perfect to the entire picture, uh, the same thing with the, the entire mix, you know, with the drums is more aggressive, more low end on it, the bass is, the attack is here, in your face is absolutely cool. And yeah, the guitar sound, I'm really pleased and really happy with it. We know that uh, on the cover there is a school, we have it there, uh, can I pick up it, or you can pick up it, yeah. maybe I can destroy it. So. Yeah, this is the sound uh, the skull, and I see it, I created it, this is my self-creation. It's a cast from an uh, old Peruvian skull, okay. uh, which I did the cast, and then I remodeled uh, the jaw, which oh. is now the sound of the jaw. And this, this skull has a speciality, it's from the 7th century, and okay. uh, <coughs> uh, back then it was fashion among the upper class of the people in, in, uh, um, that they would have their skull elo elongated, you know. You see the skull is very long here, usually a skull would, would be more round, you know. <coughs> and they did this by um, binding this, the skull of the baby, of, a, of, a, of the kid, you know, yeah. uh, when the, you know this, that the, uh, the skull parts, uh, the different bones of the skull are not connected in a, when you're a baby. So uh, when you bind this, the skull permanently, when the kid is really young, after birth, you know, then the skull grows in this long direction, <coughs> okay. which was a fashion back then. So this guy looks already like an alien, you know? Oh, yeah, you, yeah. <laughs> if you can imagine how these people looked like with, uh, with flesh on their bone, they looked pretty strange, you know? <laughs> <laughs> and I thought, this is perfect uh, sound chaser skull, it just needs a jaw, you know? And then I did this basically for, for my favor, you know? And then I showed it to the boys and they were freaking out, like, wow, cool, we have to use this. And I, get, I showed this thing to Karim Koenig, the guy that is doing our, um, our artwork since already the last album. Right. And he was also freaking out, and he came pretty shortly after this. He came up with uh, uh, all these artwork ideas, and we liked it very much. You have their 20 minutes long song. Yeah, <laughs> yeah it's, a, it's an epic, but it, it doesn't mean that it must uh, sound like Dream Theater. 
It's a 20 minute epic, uh, which is connecting four songs to one bigger picture. Um, I would uh, describe it as this is, this is um, the summary of the whole album, that everything that is happening before is like um, you get the bigger picture in this quadrilogy. And um, yeah, well, it's a um, suitable climax for the whole album. So guys, at the end, so uh, what, is your, what is your most favorite uh, track on the new album? I think we agreed today already um, because we talked about this yeah. and it, it's very difficult. We would like to uh -huh. name them all, of course, but we agreed that today is, uh, is justifying the song that we picked out. It's, a, it's the second of the quadrilogy. Exactly. Justify. Super epic, super big, super glorious. Okay, so thank you so much, guys. Thank you so much. You. So, oh, of course, you. all the best with the new album. Thank good luck, much. guys. Good luck. Uh, of course, I think we will see you on some kind of show on, on tour, of course. And everybody, stay tuned because this was the Spark TV Metal in Action! Bar TV Metal in Action Strangers in the night Fly me to the moon and let me swing among the stars <laughs> Let me see what spring is like on Jupiter and Mars In other words, please be true in other words, I'll fuck you. <laughs> <laughs>